Okay, welcome back to another episode in the series of Red Dead Redemption 2 with the worst gamer who is chilling right here in this stool. We're back. And in the spirit of chilling, of course, we need to put on the comfy slippers. They are vital. They are important for the cause of chilling. And my... <laughs> uh, trusty PS4 controller who would have thought that I couldn't trust my PS5 controller and Sony Playstation they haven't contacted me yet I mean I've sent them email after email after email here's the serial number here's the model number here's my contact information speak to me <laughs> do something but uh, they won't answer so i'll see if that takes too long I, apparently I, I i'm not able to play playstation 5 games with this control so if i play old games that's fine like uh, last generation games example this red dead redemption but i can't play this uh, robot story stuff that's uh, that's included in the bundle or in the box the ps5 box that one i can't play it says that uh, as soon as i try to start the game uh, it says i can't play with a ps4 controller so i mean come on just just get rid of the extra blurs the extra what do you call it uh, vibrations and uh, haptic feedback and get rid of all that just just don't don't use it i mean that can't be so important but apparently i can't play with the old controller so i have to play <laughs> i have to play old games with old controller new games with new controller yeah but anyway let us continue with this beautiful game and I was supposed to did I tell you I was supposed to do the Shia Trelawney mission no I should do this one Hamish and Charlotte let's do Charlotte first let's go up to Charlotte see what she's cooking what kind of food if she's hunting or if she's starving. I I didn't think there was any mission any more missions with Charlotte. I thought we were done with her. Oh and what's that? I can see. PB PB Oh PB, yeah, okay, yeah. Penelope Braithwaite. Yeah, I can do that one. That's a uh, uh, white mission white white meaning it's not essential to the main story yellow meaning it is a part of the main story the main quest line Good morning, Arthur. Jack don't throw shit at me stop throwing shit at me <laughs> stop it I mean how rude can you be he's just so small Oh, and uh, for for chilling, uh, for chilling, uh, I brought. <laughs> you can't believe how stupid I am. Uh, uh, I was about to say that I brought a a a logger from Finland. I was gonna say. Uh, this one is from Finland, but no, it's not. It says it says, says clearly here. <laughs> pure pure Swedish lager. So I mean, I just I just looked at the name. It's Sarek, and judged it to be Finnish from Finland. I don't know, <laughs> but I'm gonna I'm gonna do an episode with Finnish lager as well from Finland. Uh, Cause they're they're good, they're good. Nothing wrong with that. But this is Swedish one. 
from the northern parts of Sweden or Sarik is from northern parts of Sweden. That's a nature reserve uh, in the northern hemisphere where the, ind the indigenous people of uh, Sweden has been living for a long time. So. Yeah, it's good. It's like they say, pure. It's, it's, uh, I don't know. Of course, it's all in my head, but uh, in some sense, I can feel the more pure taste of it. But yeah, that's probably imag imaginary. Whoa, okay. I thought there was a road here. Okay, I'm lost. Hey. I thought I could ride there. <laughs> Apparently not. Okay, let's get going. And of course, my trusty jalapeno stick. Huh? Can't go wrong with that one. Oh! Oh, yep. This one was a bit, a bit more dry. I don't know if I bought a batch. It's been sitting there for long. Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Holy smokes! <laughs> Gets stuck in your teeth like crazy. What do I see? Whoa! Stop! 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 stop. I didn't tell you to go down there. Yeah. Oh. Okay, let's get going. So yeah, <clears throat> it starts already when I'm approaching this mad scientist's uh, hideout up in the mountains here, up there. It always starts raining here before before you've done his mission because when you're about to do his mission then they set the mood by storm and rain and it's a part of the mission so to say so that's why they always uh, the weather always changes when you approach uh, his house and that always kept me from doing his mission and just having it as a mood setter so whenever I want to have rain and storm I always travel up there and then I can go anywhere because the rain keeps going it doesn't end straight away so For a while. I wish that there was something else that I could do. Please call me sure. What has she done? Arthur Moore. Well, you take care of yourself, Arthur. What has <coughs> What has she Please done? Please go on in and help yourself to anything you need. What's mine is yours. Oh, well, that's very kind. Yeah, no. What, what has she done for Arthur? Okay, she, she gave him money, but I mean... Yeah. Whoa. See, I, I mean, just since he said you've done more than enough 
I don't know what that means in the context of their their relationship. So look at the storm; it's lovely. But I, I was thinking about fast traveling, and I was going to travel to Rhodes mm. to do the other mission. With Penelope? Penelope Braithwaite. No more rain? Come on. I waited for this. I thought that indication above above your health uh, on your health indicator. I thought when the, there's a weight and you're pointing down. Huh? I I don't want to get involved. I thought the weight and pointing down was uh, you're carrying too much. Uh, and that that means uh, I've been playing too much role-playing games, because <laughs> that's always the issue. Um, th there isn't much mentioning underweight and overweight, but in role-playing games, it's usually the big burden is if you're carrying too much, because you're looting all the time. So, I thought that was the same in Red Dead Redemption, but what it means is you're underweight, and if the, the arrow is pointing up, I'm overweight, so I'm fat. <laughs> so, essentially, this game is fat, fat shaming me and, and thin shaming me. No, seriously. But yeah. <clears throat> I'm underweight since I have tuberculosis, so that's the only the only conclusion. So these islands, I think I can go out to these islands. I think I can row out to them. I'm gonna do that uh, in the background, not not when we're recording like this. Uh, Weren't see. Weren't she supposed to be in the gazebo? Maybe not this time. Oh, she's in the... Oh, she's over here, yeah. <laughs> she has her own little cabin, cause... The Braithwaite mansion is no more. It's just a pile of... I don't know. Ash. Pile of ash. Hello there, Penelope. How's your life now? Oh, oh you came! You came! You finally came! I came. Oh, thank you, thank you, you lovely, lovely man. Well, come down, yes. She's oh, come desperate. On, we ain't got a minute to lose. They killed her! They killed Miss Calhoun! All she wanted was a better lot for women, and they killed her, those pigs. Oh, Calhoun. My the... cousins, probably, or, or bows. Well, you met them. They are animals. Not even animals. Monsters. Monsters, if God had lost the, the all feminist his powers of imagination. Can you... Organization? Can you please take me to the train station? Bo will be waiting. Bo, why couldn't he come and rescue you? Well, if they saw me and him together, they'd lynch him and send me off to a nunnery. Or maybe they'd lynch us both. Nunnery. I ain't quite sure. They do so love hanging folk. Where are you heading? Up to Boston. Good. Yeah, I like you up there. Come on. You been there, Arthur? Of course. I'm in your hands. Just get me to Rhodes Railway Station. 
Okay, let's try and get you a train. Bo's just waiting at the station in the hope you'll show up. Or I'll show up to help you show up. He goes to there every day he can. Makes up some excuse or other. I said he would see me there one day soon, and today he will. God willing. Okay. Well, well. He... Does this mean I have to shoot? There, that's true love, all right. I've hardly seen him since the rally. They watched me so carefully, and he's waited, or so his letters say. Our families won't let us out. And then all that business with Aunt Catherine and my cousins. <sighs> you saw the house. And then Lee Gray and those boys killed. <sighs> so much bloodshed. I, I, you'd think this could be a new beginning, but everyone left alive. They're even more angry. Maybe anger's a complicated thing to let go of. Something good has to come out of this awful, awful feud. That's what I've been hoping. Bo and I have to be better. Our families were here for years and years. Sometimes I feel like we can't just leave death and, and pain and ruination behind us. <clears throat> plenty before you have. Plenty will again. But, yeah. As far as it goes, get out. Don't look back. Make something decent of your lives. He's a good man, isn't he? Bo. There are worse. <laughs> he's kind and he's caring and he's strong. <laughs> yeah, but he didn't there get he you. Is. Oh, it's him. Will Where? you ride on the train with us a little, just to the first stop? Fine. Oh, nobody would catch me with that fat lady. Huh? Okay. You came! You came! At <laughs> last you came! Oh, no. My sweet, my best of men! <laughs> oh, I'm hardly a man at all. But I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, how can we ever repay your kindness? Mm, some of them jewels would do just fine. Bo, Arthur's gonna join us. I think we need the support. Please, could you buy the tickets, dear Mr. Morgan? We we can't chance being seen. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. We'll meet you on the platform. <clears throat> Can I have three tickets to San Denis, please, sir? Uh, of course. <sighs> oh, hello, sir. Hello, Alden. I hope all is well. Uh, not terribly. Good to see you. Hey. Excuse me, Alden. Get on the train. Get your bags, miss. I got this. Come here, Yankee. With pleasure, you goddamn fairy. Want to come back here without giving oh. you a whipping? We should have done this last time. Get on the train, Paul. Go to your wolf, aren't you? Four fists and maybe one brain between you. You're gonna get hurt, cowboy. Get him, Scott. Come on, Arthur. If that is his real name, it doesn't matter. He can fly. Yeah, well, I just need to take care of this. Come on. I had you before. Okay. Hello. Hello, future. All right, all done. That is quite a family you've got there, son. I know. Charming to the last. Then again, my uncle used to keep his own half-brother as a slave. So, what do you expect? Good manners? My uncle used to say things were better the way they were when he could rape and kill with impunity and he didn't have to work a day in his life. Both our families. 
There's good people in this county, but our families bully them and drove most of them off. Whites as well as blacks, all over this silly feud. Yeah. Well, how to life. Oh. Oh my lord. Arthur got a cut. Oh, I think it's my second cousin. Second cousin? How many cousins do you have? I think they found out about the jewels. Right. Keep your heads down. I'll deal with this. Jewels? I knew you had some damn. Whoa. Must Come on. Have all the jewels in the state, the amount of your Should I shoot them with this one? Come on, can I get some cover? There we go. No! Oh, <laughs> look at that! Look at him jump! Ow! That hurt! I'm hurt now. No one else? some steam when you get too angry it's good to blow off some steam same thing with the boiler when it's get too hot when you're too hot-headed blow off some steam there we go whoa the bisons look at that I didn't know there were bisons in these parts. I've only been hunting them in the up up on the other side of the towards the hills towards the mountains. Okay. Go, go. So, weren't we going to Saint Denis? Wouldn't it be easier going the other direction? Then you would be going straight for Saint Denis, wouldn't you? I don't know what kind of sides. Sides, uh, side track this is this is like you're going from Rhodes to strawberry over over to over the mountains and God knows where uh, then to Saint Denis feels like why? Why would you go this route? Yeah, I don't know. 
it's not too logical. Since Saint Denis is just neighboring roads. It's best you go on alone from here. Mr. Arthur, I didn't know you could drive a train. Did I. <laughs> but if I'm honest, it was kind of fun. And I didn't kill any of us. Well, I killed some of your relatives, but they would have killed all of us. You are a gentleman, sir. Oh, no, I ain't. Yes, you are. Here, I ain't got much money, but these sapphires are worth a lot of money. No, oh, you take them. Heirloom. That Braithwaite treasure. No. I couldn't take it. You no. need it. Let's get you off to Boston before any more your relatives show up. That might be wise. Hey, you there. Yeah? This couple is heading up north to the Boston line. They got money, they'll pay you on arrival. That work for you? Yeah, sounds fine. Get on in. Hey, uh... You carry protection on a journey like this? I wouldn't be much of a stage driver if I didn't. It goes everywhere I do. Hey! Oh. Miss Braithwaite is going to hold on to this until arrival. Hmm? <laughs> on account of the it's treasure on your person. Oh. I don't know how to thank you. Uh -huh. You're a fine man, sir. Just get out of here. I'll leave. Yeah. Give them some money for the ride. I don't know if they have... Anything. Okay, I should have been faster. What? Complete within seven minutes and thirty seconds. Okay, I, I don't care. I don't care. No problem. Okay. So. Where are you? He's well, well camouflaged, and he's pooping again, dude. You're always pooping when I arrive, Girl. when I'm close to you, when I'm about to to saddle up and go on my Let's journeys. Go. Why are you cursing at me? Uh. Okay, so the next mission I should do is no, I can't do that. No. Okay, should should I go to Emerald Ranch? I fast travel to Emerald Ranch. No. Wrong button. <clears throat> Emerald Ranch. I can't do it at sundown or why can't I do the mission with fast travel? Emerald Ranch. There we go. Oh, I had some sticks as well. Or pretzels. Just that in Sweden. <laughs> we couldn't uh, put effort into it and fold them like presses are supposed to oh, oh. like presses are supposed, supposed to be fo folded uh, so in Sweden we said ah, what the hell just make a stick out of it <laughs> that's much easier Mm. It's quite late in the day. Okay, should we go up to to the lake and uh, camp? Maybe we go up there and camp. I don't think there's much else I can do if I'm not doing the Trelawney mission, but that's one of my favorites, so... 
I don't want it to go to waste, just like that. Maybe I want to dedicate a whole mission or a whole episode on that mission, because it's it's uh, it's really good in the ending when you meet the uh, nun that you've met in in uh, Saint Denis and talk about life and existence and meaning of life and what you you should do with your life. So yeah, that's a good mission. Or should I go up to this camper? See if th this this guy is friendly. Hello, Mr. Senor. Senor, couldn't couldn't we talk? Maybe sit down by the campfire, sing kumbaya or something. Rest by the fire. Can I sleep here? No, I can only cook. Can I cook something? Really? I don't think so, no. I have nothing to cook. Nothing. No. Oh man. Oh, I'm all out of ingredients, so I'm screwed. But I thought this guy might... Might be wanted to tell his story, and we could sit down and have a relaxing chat, just like we're doing now, relaxing, uh, chilling. I mean, <laughs> I thought that dude was gonna chill with me. Apparently not. Let's go to Ho Hosea, Ho no, Horatio, ha Hestatio, Host. Ah, I can't remember. Yeah. Is it dawn or is it just the moonlight? Oh, it's in the middle of the night, 12.50. This must be a very bright moon. Lights up like this. Okay, let's just camp. We, we, whoa! That's the dangers of being out here in 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 the middle of nowhere. Okay, it's not a perfect, it's a good pelt. Okay, let's make a campfire and sing kumbaya, cook some food. It's best we do that. Stow it away. This one. Ah, uh, it's also good. Not perfect. I think I'm gonna skip forward during this process, but because this is not too too fun. 
Where's my food? I can't make any food. I have too much. Oh, I have too much of. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, let's just sleep. Morning. Rain a day. Gideon. Can I still meet up with the? Uh... Yeah, Hamish. Ah, oh. Hamish. Yeah, that's the guy in. Uh... Isn't that the guy in uh, Braveheart? William Wallace's uh, uh, friend since uh, childhood. Uh, the one who, who's red hair, red haired, and uh, when he grows up, he's the the big tall guy throwing the big rock. That's Hamish, right? I think his name was Hamish. That's a quite quite an old uh, name. If it's from the time of William Wallace, I think his name was Hamish. <clears throat> By the way, that's that's uh, one of my favorite movies. I know it's uh, I know it's very cliche and it's very non-true. It's like fictional, very fictional. Not a characterization of uh, the true events. <gasps> what the hell? A wolf in the water? Where did you come from? What? What's going on? Why were you in the water? Okay. Yeah, I know it's not a true reflection of uh, the historical events of uh, William Wallace, Wallace and uh, the Scottish freedom fighters, and it's very, very cheesy with the oh, for freedom. Wow! But anyway, if you exclude all that, or if you can look past all that. I think it's one of the greatest movies. Uh, my absolute favorite is uh, Alien One, number one from 79, 1979, and uh, Shining, The Shining. From I think it was recorded 1979, got released 1980. That's with Jack Nicholson. That's a really, really good movie. Uh, that's three of my favorite movies. Uh, actually, I like I like the whole. <laughs> did he did he get scared? Can he play with me because my recent action in his vicinity? Why? Why don't you want to play with me? Because I shot a wolf. That wolf was gonna get me, you know? He was going to kill me. Do you need some time to think? Because I shot a gun? Or what? Why? Now? I can go back now? Okay. 
Yeah, of course I like modern movies as well. But I mean, those are my like my all-time favorites. Oh, and The Thing, The Thing. The Thing is a really good movie from 1982. And Blade Runner. Blade Runner is really really good. That's the same director as uh, Alien 1 from 1979. Those are really good movies. Wow wow we are. I watch them all the time. Actually, Denis Villeneuve, the new Blade Runner, Blade Runner 2049, that's a really good movie as well. Hamish! Arthur! <laughs> Come in. You said uh, we could go for a hunt. I did! There's this... You she-wolf been stalking me the last few nights I've been out, but mm. she can wait. Let's talk a while. Sure. So what do you do? Me? Uh, I'm a wanderer. I was born further north, but I spent a lot of time out west. Funny. I never saw myself as a wanderer. Okay. These <laughs> lay so thick, you could have walked across the whole field without your boots touching mud. <sighs> Those were bad times. Mm. Yes, they were. Would you like some more coffee? Please. I'm oh, sorry. Just a second. <laughs> <laughs> what have we here? Yeah. She's right across there. That close. Oh, 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 oh. She's acting brazen. Come on. Let's mount up. Come on. She went around to the left. Around the lake. She's down here somewhere. So Hamish and me going on a little hunt. Yes, yes. Yep. Come on. Wolf shouldn't come so close to people. Yeah, it's strange. When the whole country was wild, they could go where they liked. Now they're stuck hiding in the few corners of wilderness we got left. It's a feeling with which I can sympathize. <laughs> this ain't a country for wild animals, nor wild men, neither. Yep. Not anymore, it seems. You hear that? Yep. Quickly now. This way. <coughs> Up there. On the outcrop. You see her? Oh. Let's go around it. Okay, I'm with you. Are you sure it's her? We're on to her. Come on. Okay. Okay. Damn! I can't see her! Let's get up to the top! Have a look around from up there! You loves hills, don't you, boy? You eat them up for breakfast. Okay. <laughs> sure. Let him work. What we got here? Is that a fresh kill? Could be. Is the blood set? <sighs> Take a look. Yep, that was her dinner. She didn't eat much, looks like. Now where'd she get to? Over there. Whoa, more, but more yes. carcasses? She's somewhere over there. No, there's a whole lot of over there. <laughs> That's the problem. There she is. Got shy all of a sudden. You got some extra miles in you tonight. Oh, if we gotta chase. Let's chase her. 
Shouldn't get too close. She might smell you. They are they are essentially essentially dogs or dogs are essentially wolves, so they can smell perfectly. Better to be on foot. Send your horse somewhere safe. Get going, girl. There's a wolf about. You went in there, all right. We got a tracker. Now you want to take the lead, or shall I? Uh, I'll follow. I'd prefer if you did it. That's all right. Okay, I'll track her. Stick to me. Got the trail. This way. Keep behind me. Let's take this slow. Yeah, okay, you're right. Put your gun out just in case. You're going in the right direction. She could be a half mile in front of us. You're good at this. <laughs> I'm patronizing him. Of course he's good at this. This is the, all he's okay. been doing. Right? I got mine in the dirt. For all his life. Or the later part of, parts of his life at least. Head down here. Yeah, that's where I would have gone as well. I see her. I see her. Oh shit. I see her. She's angry. I think we're close. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I said. Hey, a bear. Is that the she wolf? Yeah. What what should I do? Yeah, that's her. Not Hamish. You all right? <laughs> I was ready to offer my complete and unconditional. Yeah, I don't <laughs> think the wolves would have shown much mercy. That's quite an ambush she let us into. Yeah, bushwhacking, I'd call it. <laughs> bushwhacking? Over here! Over here! <laughs> Whoa! That, that was the Big son of a bitch. male. That of That's the best of them. Look at them. Proud thing. Scary thing. <laughs> they brought us here to be slaughtered. You were after a hunt. Yeah. Yeah, and I guess I got hunted. <laughs> you going back to the cabin? Yeah, nah. Still early. We'll stay up here a while. Dress this animal. We'll Chris? likely see another like him for some time. Yeah, I hope I won't neither. Thanks for taking me out. Yeah, anytime. You want to go out again? 
You come by and see me. So long, then. Yeah. Wait. Here's a pelt. Thank you. Uh, you earned it. So long. What did I get? It's a good pelt. I thought I would get a... Perfect. Can I get a perfect? Let's see if this is one. Perfect. Skin. Poor. Well, this one. If I don't skin him and take the meat, I think I'll get bad karma. I think you do. Poor. Come on. It's late at night. I'm looking for a perfect pelt. Poor. Okay. Perfect. That's a perfect one. Can I skin this one? No, I can't. <laughs> okay, let's back to the tanner. Go this way. Yeah, let's turn in this pelt. This is some rocky, rocky, rocky mountains. And still, I don't think it's the rocky mountains. Oh! Whoa. get to the oh there's a elk yep can i point <gasps> oh shit oh snap why can't i shoot What's going on? Come on. No, come on. That was a... No. That was a hit. That was a perfect hit. Sorry. Sorry. That 
That was a perfect hit, wasn't it? In the head. Yeah. So now I've been hunting a bit. Perfect elk. Okay, yeah. Good. Good, 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 good. Come on. There you are. Yeah, I've seen a lot of things, but you? <laughs> what a suck. What? Are you insulting me? We're, we're alone at this high altitude. At this lake. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. I almost forgot. We were about to. This is a, a treasure hunt as well. Do you remember why we were going here in the first while? The reason was the Jack Hall gang uh, treasure map. And I'm gonna do that now. Because that map pointed. Let's see. Letters. Treasure maps. Jack Hall gang map 3. This one. I don't know if you can see it, but that island, that's in the, oh, you can see one, two, three uh, mountain tops in the background, and those are these three mountain tops, one, two, three. So. You'll get over here, swim a bit. And go up here. Well, that one, that rock, I think so. Yeah, examine rock. No, that one. Okay. Two gold bars. Wow. Follow all the clues, little blah blah blah. blah. Uncover two gold bars bird on a small island, Craig's run. <sighs> okay, that's good. Let's get back. New reinforced equipment. That's good. Always good with new equi equi equipment. The treasure hunter. Uh, equipment. Who is that? Who's, whose horse is that? Kentucky Saddler. I don't know. Okay then, girl. Let's go. Can we get up here? Let's go to the trapper. Maybe we can buy something new. I mean, I love this episode. Uh, since I get to do one of these missions with uh, Hamish. William Wallace's best friend. Hamish.
and I get to go out in the forest and hunt. So let's get up here. The trapper isn't far away. I just don't know what, what way is faster. That way. Let's go down the mountain. I'm getting a bit lightheaded, so I'm not the best. Uh, I'm not in control of my controls. <laughs> Let's see if we can go down here. Yeah, wor works just as well. Uh, almost. <laughs> Hello there. Glad to see you again, sir. I want to oh, sell. Okay, let's take a look at it. Perfect squirrel. Antlers. A uh, black bear claw. I, I can sell that. Perfect muskrat. Some hearts. Four good pelts. I can stack four. Four good pelts, those, one huh? perfect, and one perfect elk. That's a lot. That's a lot. So I think I can have five pelts, regular pelts, and one uh, big, big animal. Yeah, I'll sell these. Boom. I've run this stall uh, all the way from here to the border. The northern border, that is. And I've never Squirrel been tail. Before. I don't know. Okay. Been a pleasure doing business with you. So, I think that's it for this episode. And I'll continue in the next one. Where I will... I'll do the Trelawney mission in the next episode. Thanks. Going with Trilani and uh, meeting Rainfalls and uh, what's his name again? Rainfalls and yeah. yeah, I'm gonna meet with the indigenous people and try to help them in their pursuit of happiness. No, in their dealings with the general see if I can help in that situation I don't think I can but I'll try so let's end it here where the sun is going up this is very moodful no oh that's the moon yeah what time is it Five thirty-six. Okay, yeah. The, the sun is going up. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, I, I want to save this moment. I need to save this. I'll save here. So that's it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed this uh, as much as I did. I'm chilling, taking it easy, relaxing, and having a lager and watching this beautiful game I mean what more can you ask for I don't know 
I'm not asking for more, so... <laughs> yeah. Let's end it on this beautiful note, and take care. Hope you have a great life, and uh, maybe I'll see you in the next one. Who knows? Bye!